Hi, this is John Guidry. Today I'm going to demo the HXC floppy emulator for you. This piece of hardware was made by a gentleman over in Europe who um, wanted a replacement for floppy drives for retro computers. I believe this originally first uh, was meant for the Commodore Amiga. And he came up with this little nice device which allows you to insert a floppy drive over USB from a host operating system with a uh, output right here of a regular disk cable. And I've got this hooked up to my uh, core comp uh, down here, my mini expansion system. And uh, it's going to be hooked up as disk one. I'm going to go ahead and demo it working uh, on a TI-994A for you. Um, it supports PC-99 disk images. So it, it can go and uh, uh, you can insert any disk on a PC here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, insert the power to it, which you'll notice uh, some of the lights, uh, or maybe not, some of the lights come on. Actually, the green one uh, came on there. And on the PC side here, on the Dell Mini, which is going to be my little uh, <laughs> TI-99 peripheral right now, we're going to go ahead and start the HXC program. And uh, it's kind of hard to see, but this is a pretty small, simple little program. There's some options and stuff you can change, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to tell it to load a uh, PC-99 uh, floppy. So let's go ahead and just load this one because I know what's on this one. And you see at the bottom... It's scrolling it. It says the disk name. It says it's 40 track, two sides. And it says the disk name. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to fire up the 4A here. We're going to go into Extended Basic. And let's load this program. Um, actually, we're going to go ahead and run it. Run psk1.banjo. And you notice that the, the light on it's flashing. And you notice the 32K lights flashing there. And the and actually the disc lights flashing too, but you can't see it. And on this side you see at the bottom you'll see the the track, you know, just move from 16 to 17. So it'll show you where it's at on the floppy itself in the little utility. And uh, here you go. The program's running. Uh, this was kind of a spoof on dueling banjos that somebody made with the TMS 9900 on the top and the 9901 on the bottom. I don't know if you can you can see that on here or not, but uh, interesting little program. So anyway, this thing's got full read-write support. So if you wanted to uh, you want to use it as your uh, library for your PC 99 discs, and you have a little a little uh, PC peripheral right next to your system here. It's probably the perfect little uh, little accessory here. I know it it doesn't uh, exactly replace the uh, the compact flash, the CF7 Plus, but uh, you know it's kind of cool if you have a huge library of PC99 discs and you just want to be able to load them on the fly and read and write them and change them on the, on the PC through PC99 or another emulator. But uh, uh, that's that's all for this demo. I uh, appreciate you watching, and uh, thank you, thank you very much to the maker of this uh, awesome little piece of uh, equipment.